What's good y'all? Coming to you again with another video. You can't defeat your demons if you still enjoy, enjoy their company. I saw this on a meme and I was like, sick. How can you say that you don't enjoy being hurt? How can you say that you don't enjoy a person being harmful towards you or disrespectful towards you or harm you in any kind of way? Being demonic, demonic towards you when out of everything that person do to you, you still accept it. How can you say you don't want something at the same end in the same sense, accept it? Let me tell you what, what you do when you do that. When you say you don't want something, but you still deal with it, the only thing you're doing is making excuses for it. When you make excuses for something, you figure, you find in your brain anything you can say or do to accept that situation. So prime example, if you have someone that's always treating you wrong, meaning they are always bullying you or you have someone that speaks down on you a lot, you have someone that don't believe in nothing you're doing, you still justify their love in some kind of way, even though that person don't give a damn about you and you know that. How can you say you don't enjoy a demon when you enjoy them cheating on you? You enjoy that same demon having sex with you even though you know that they are doing the same even though you know they are doing the same thing with another person. Think about it. You hate this demon so much that you love them enough to stay in your life and still be a demon. Even though you know what a demon is. You know a demon will never, ever be good for you. Ever. And you know this because anything that's good for you will not hurt you, will not harm you, will not have you feeling like you're nothing, you're nobody, you're miserable. That's when you know that it's a den den demonic situation. So what do you do to get rid of the situation? You leave. You leave the situation. You block contact with the situation. You don't let the situation enter your life in no kind of way at all. Don't let this person in your life influence you to believe that in order for you to, to be loved or cared for, that that person is the only person can do it for you. Because that's not true. It's not true. So, my advice to you is, put your crown on. Yeah. Remember that you have a crown. And even for guys, remember that you, in order for you to be at your top potential, you have to have a good person by your side. A demon is the same people that will allow you to do things that they yeah. that will send you to jail, that will take your family away, that will not elevate you in no kind of way. If you've been doing the same thing for five years, three years, 10 years, and you have not changed anything that you have been doing, you might need to evaluate what you are associate yourself around and the people that's in your life. Because those people might be demons towards you. If those people are not influencing you to do better than you already been doing, then maybe they are demons in your life. 
my advice again is to evaluate your cert your circle evaluate your surroundings evaluate yourself sit in sit in company with yourself sit in company with yourself and your mind your heart will tell you exactly what you need what you got to say son thank you guys for watching this video